Tell me when. Stop. Miguel Perez. Yeah. Another one of my former students. He's in college now, but he was in my uh, YMCA program for many years. Are you college he goes to? College? I don't. I don't know where he ended up. If you uh, talk to him, find out for me. All right. Hello. Hello, Mr. Perez. This is not Perez. Oh, who is this? That doesn't matter. This isn't oh. Perez. I'm... Oh no, I think I think uh, I have you put down in my phone wrong. Probably. Who is this? Um, this is Tony Winthorpe. He uh, I, I work with the uh, college. Yeah, I don't go to college. Oh, you don't? No. You should. And you really? sound like you're about ten. I'm not ten. I work at the college. I'm sure you do. So, uh, are you ever interested in going to college? No. Oh, why not? Because I have a job. Because I'm an adult. Oh, so adults have jobs? Yeah, it's kind of crazy. If you were an adult that actually had a job, you would understand well, that. I'm, a, I'm an adult, but I don't have a job because I work at the college. If you work at the college, that's a job. No, but I just like, <laughs> go around and like pick up the trash. So you're the landscaper. No, I just pick up trash. <laughs> I'm like a garbage yeah. man, but like they don't trust me to drive the truck. So they just send me around with like one of those little sticks and I pick up all the trash. Sounds like an inmate's job. I don't go to jail. I work at the college. <laughs> inmates are the only ones that have the little stick things that have to go around picking up trash. Well, that's, that's stereotypical. Just because I'm not in prison, I can't use the pickup stick. Yeah. How do you feel about that? I just don't feel appreciated the job I do on keeping campus clean. I'm sorry, I don't want to make you feel unappreciated. Oh, thank you. I just got to use the grown-up stick too, so I'm like really happy. I guess that's good. Yeah, it's really good. So if you're not 10, how old are you? I'm actually, I'm actually 63. I just have like a really squeaky voice. You might want to get that checked out. There might be something wrong with your with your throat or something. Are you like a doctor? Can you help me? Sorry, I'm not a doctor. I work at an insane asylum. I work with crazy people. Wait, are, are you like a therapist? Nope. I'm just the one that gives everybody their shots and puts them to sleep. It's kind of fun. Oh, so you kill people with the shots? <laughs> Sometimes. It really depends. Oh, like they're too crazy? Yeah, they're too crazy. Can you put me to sleep with the shot? I could, but there's no promises that you'll wake up. Oh, so you do kill, kill people with the shot? Sometimes. Oh, well, I gotta go now. My mom's calling. <laughs> Bye. No, I have no idea. It must have changed the. I'll have to get rid of Miguel in my contacts. And, yeah, I was like, hey, dude, but this is a chick. And put the mystery uh, psycho person. Yeah. <laughs> what, does she actually go, like, work at a What do you mean? I don't. Uh, I, uh, she you know, might have been franking us like we were franking her. Hey, you know what I forgot? Back when I used to do this as a kid, the my number would not show up on other people's phones. Oh, but whatever. All right, good job.